Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy Black OG. Or as my YouTube channel says, Black OG Jesus. <laughs> so, I asked you guys a question. Or, what video would you like to see? And basically, I waited a day to see how or what got, or what you guys would wanted to see so and basically here's what I got four reasons why men should focus on themselves and uh yeah man so let's get into this real quick switch out of this uh this is going to be in no particular order or anything by the way this is the freaking shitty ass phone <laughs> that I record all my videos on uh... can't wait to get a new one but anyways and like I said these are gonna be in no particular order so let's get straight into it four reasons why men should uh... focus on themselves status, looks, resources um... if you guys focus on staying in shape or becoming more masculine uh, or learning how to tell bitches no or basically you know just developing yourself not giving attention to women uh, these females will eventually come to you especially when they notice that you're not paying attention to them because women they love attention attention is their currency and they can't live without it but they're gonna they, <laughs> they better freaking learn how soon because MGTOW was taken over baby and there's actually a lot of young men that are freaking waking up saying they're not getting married or they don't want to have kids and when I say young men I'm not talking about 22 year old men like me I'm talking about freaking 18 17 16 year old dudes so it's like oh my gosh these females are so screwed just wait until the next just wait until all these 12 through 18 year olds get into their early to mid to late 20s and they're gonna realize that they don't have a freaking soon they're gonna realize how many men don't want to get married anyways uh another reason why guys should focus on themselves because nowadays women they like to do the bait and switch and if you don't know what the bait and switch is basically um, after you fully committed and invested uh, given a lot of time attention resources to a woman uh, all of a sudden she wants uh, also marriage, kids, uh, a house, cars, and stuff like that. All of a sudden she wants to change. All of a sudden she wants to go back out uh, dancing on the club against men's, uh, random men's junk. Um, or she wants to freaking chop up her hair or get into feminist ideologies or the worst part which is point number three I guess I don't know <laughs> or reason number three uh, you don't have to deal with divorce alimony child support uh, or false allegations uh, and today we live in a country where a good man, a good loyal man who's been busting his ass for a woman. We live in a time where a woman can basically take advantage of that, steal his house, steal all of this money, all of this things that he's worked hard for, cheat on him, and she'll be rewarded. That's the kind of society that we're living in right now and then females want to wonder why they ain't getting married anymore because y'all want to pull the bait and switch completely switch around or 
like freaking that chick Aisha Curry. Uh, you're salty that you're not getting attention from men anymore, even though you're dating a freaking superstar. Come on now. This is why you can't freaking. Women can't be satisfied today. Like, Steph Curry is worth, like, millions of dollars, and this woman is c complaining, saying she's not satisfied. Unbelievable. So just remember that, guys. It doesn't matter how much money you have. Uh, these women, they've just been indoctrinated thanks to feminism and thanks to their female friends. Um, they get influenced as well. Or they get influenced by the women that they look up to. Because, uh, let's be honest, uh, most of the women that today's females look up to some of them are narcissistic, uh, some of them have no personality, some of them are strippers, uh, prostitutes, or used to be, be before they are famous. Uh, for example, Cardi B, a lot of females look up to her for some reason. Um, Alimony and child support, uh, well, that's really kind of self-explanatory, you know? Al uh, it, it just, from what I've heard, I've never been, I've obviously never been in a marriage, and I've obviously never been in a divorce. <laughs> However, um, I probably never will, lucky me. And it's all thanks to the red pill, it's all thanks to MGTOW, but anyways, alimony, child support, basically women extorting cash from you using the government, uh, which I find funny because, you know, women are supposed to be strong and independent, but uh, every time, every time something difficult approaches, every time something hard happens, every time some bullshit is happening. They want to go to Big Daddy government. They want to start uh, hashtags. They want to uh, go on a stupid movement to get their way. Instead of working hard, uh, shutting up and taking it like how men do, how men have done since the beginning of time, we just shut up and take it and we keep going. That's what makes us men. Anyway, it's, uh, allegations, allegations, oh boy, now, allegations can win a lot of men in jail, prison, uh, for claims that aren't even real. There are many women today that are using the he sexually harassed me excuse. They want to tweet that instead instead of going to the cops like a real victim would like a real victim should but instead they want to go on Twitter and then tweet whoever freaking abused them whoever uh, graped them and basically for that guy uh, you're guilty until proven innocent Shoot, I think there's something going on with Justin Bieber. He's dealing with a sexual harassment case. Justin Bieber, of all people, man. <laughs> wow. And then... Reason number four, man. Um, passions and self-discovery. Like, man... If you stay single, you will... Well, as long as you don't have pussy on your mind all the time. I'm not going to lie. I'm a thirsty dude. Um, I'm 22, so <laughs> I'm not going to act like p pussy ain't always on my mind. Or I'm not always thinking about her. Ah, I can't even say her. I can't talk today, but you, I hope you guys know what I'm trying to say. But anyways, focus on your passions. Focus on uh, discovering things that you might like. Or just learning things, you know, man. Uh, 
Now, my passions might be different from yours, but some of my passions include beatboxing. Uh, and I'm also a rapper. I, I like to freestyle for the fun of it. By the way, I hope you like that quick beat that I dropped. If it was garbage, let me know. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, man, just freaking focus on a passion or a fine one. And who knows, you might even freaking be able to create a business out of it. You might be able to make uh, money from that passion. Unfortunately for me, I'm not sure if I want to pursue the passion of... Uh, being a rapper, at least a mainstream or a famous rapper, because, you know, I preach truth, and we live in a world where when celebrities preach truth, they die, and then the media will just paint them as, or the media will just lie and say, uh, that they overdose, they uh, su uh, committed suicide, um, a random car crash, or random gang violence. Those are some of the things. And then people would just instantly believe it or crap like that. So I kind of have to find or develop another passion, which sucks. Because I have the potential to be a freaking millionaire with freestyling, with my freestyling or rapping. And I know I'm better than most of these mumble rappers. Oh, wicked, oh, wicked, oh, jiggy, oh, jiggy. Nah. <laughs> I'm better than most of these freaking mumble rappers that rap about doing drugs and lean and all that shit. But, you know, like I said, we live in a society where. If I were to drop any of it, it imagine if I were to pursue the uh, pursue my passion of rapping, and I got millions, and millions of followers, and I talk about subjects like this or subjects like how the government is freaking corrupt, I'd probably be gone soon, real soon. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is my video. I hope you guys liked it. And I'll catch you in the next one, man. And uh, I'll hope you take the quality. Maybe I should use my computer more often. But anyways.